All right, next one on the list, 1910 Hampton Avenue, still in Newport News. Um, so like always, tell you, uh, let's zoom up on the house, do a little 360 in the neighborhood. So from the outside look, it's right here. A little bit of a uh, front yard, both sides. <clears throat> you can definitely fit about four cars in here. And then it's a detached garage right there. So you don't have a big enough port to be able to pull your car back there. Um, you could easily make that garage or the, um, the, the fence a little bit bigger. This is someone else's property though, going straight back. So um that's this none of this is yours it's only right here back to the detached this used to be the garage but they renovated that into the primary bedroom so we'll see that once we go inside but do a little 360. very quiet road all right let's head on inside big <clears throat> giant long porch did some landscaping out front. Got an outlet and then your uh, plumbing clean out right there. All right, let's head on in. So this, I don't know if, it's definitely a, a rehab. Um, you can see while we're walking through a little blue tapes, that just means the builder probably um, came through and said that these things need to be touched up. I read that there's, there was no door stop. So handle went through, so they patched it, need to paint it and that kind of stuff. But open floor plan so living area kitchen dining area even maybe a formal dining over there um this is just like a breezeway and then you got the washer and dryer over there but nice big area that's a electric uh fireplace granite countertops double sink they're still missing the knobs for the um cabinets but stainless steel appliances Windows need to be a little bit cleaned up, but um, as well over here. It's be a desk if you would like it to be. Um, cat more cabinetry, or you could even put a, a wine cooler down there because uh, it's got a plug in to it. So, um, but we'll check over to the right first. First bedroom. I'll say maybe it's about twelve by twelve room. Single door closet. Again, you'll see the blue tape marks. Just means that they're having to redo some things on the left. Renovated full bath, lights in the ceiling, fan, vanity, commotes, and then a standing shower. Next bedroom on the right. Another one that has like a little nook area. Um, so again, you could maybe put the bed over there and that little area right here, have your dressers and stuff. Another single door closet. Last bedroom on the right. Vanity, commode, and then tub shower combo. Going into the two door closet. <clears throat> Let's head on to the other side before we head to the backyard. Like I said, this was the garage. A little bit of a step down right there but yeah i would consider this now the primary you consider the other one um or if anything this like an ensuite and then that the primary at the very end but to each his own um i would consider this more because you got the full bath and you got two uh closets so and you also have the panel box over there but newer these are the two new windows the rest of this original windows just needs to be a little bit cleaned up but New, new window, closet. I said panel box. Looks like it's been updated to walk-in closet. 
and then your uh, full bath. Commote, vanity, stand up shower. And then let's check over here. So like I said, you can save it, maybe have your dining, eating area right here. Um, I don't know what you would wanna put here. If anything, you can maybe use this as like your pantry, since you don't have one of those. Maybe just easily built a wall or door right there and just have a reach-in pantry, but um, I'm not sure what you could make that. But side-by-side, -side, washer and dryer with a window in it. Heading outside, new deck. So we got two, two garages and an outside patio area that you only can get to if you go outside. So we got the detached garage. We got this shed area. I don't have the keys for this door. Um, that's just like only that little area right there. I'm gonna walk over there, but still. Um, but it does have power to it. You can see all the outlets on it and the, the energy, the line going right there. <clears throat> and this one has um, power to it as well. But we'll check on the left one first, the detached. Um, that's where your uh, old AC was, your gas lines. So they're still doing a lot of things to us, so like be mindful of the ground and everything. All this stuff will be cleaned up. But there was a door right there, probably from the garage to come outside, because all this is new wood. So, um, yeah, they put, just made this a screened in porch kind of area. Um, and that's where your new primary bedroom is and bath situation. So, and then your detached garage said, look past all the stuff. This is just from the renovations. All right, now, head over to that one like I said I don't have the keys to the other part and I didn't go inside of it yet so I don't know if it wraps around um, but I'm pretty sure it's just that little corner part that's by itself like I just mentioned but you do have um, this the side gate to go out to wherever you I guess need to go cross space access door um, so yeah, I was correct. So yeah, this shed part is only for, or this door is only for this little side shed. Um, I can, I can't get in there, but you probably can see in there. So you just open the door area and then your wire lines and then it goes back a little deeper. I right there. And then here, uh, side yard so so like i said look past a lot of it because they're still doing a lot of work to the uh, property um i already spoke to the listing agent about that so um <clears throat> like i said they still gotta put the unit up and then clean up a lot of the stuff so all right well, yeah that is the second property in Newport News. Definitely let me know what you think of it. Um, and I'm going to now turn off the lights, head to the second property. So sorry for dropping my, almost dropped my phone right there. I usually have my stick, but I don't have it today. So appreciate it. Let you guys know I uploaded. I'll see you in the next one.